Shelby County. It's a great weekend in April and this Saturday Martha Lane Collins seniors and juniors will be celebrating Masquerade. It's their prom dinner. A little different than the usual traditional celebration, but that's what the students wanted and we hope they have a wonderful time celebrating together and also a very, very safe time while they're celebrating. We want all of our students to be back in school on Monday and uh, remember the time in a great, great way. Also, I wanted to talk to you about a couple of things that are happening that you need to hear about, and I'm going to take you to the expert now. Susan Dougal, who is our Chief Academic Officer, is going to be telling you about the Senate Bill 128 and deadlines that are coming that you need to be aware of. And she's also going to give you a little preview about Expedition IL-3, our summer learning program. Hello, I'm Susan Dougal, Chief Academic Officer of Shelby County Public Schools. And today I want to talk to you a little bit about something you may have heard in the newsletters and previous videos and on the news. And that's Senate Bill 128, which is often called the Supplemental Year Law. And currently I just want to update you where we are in Shelby County on that. We have been meeting with state officials uh, to get guidance on that. And now we are, have opened up a form. If you are interested in your student, your child, retaking courses or taking supplemental courses from this previous year, the current year we're in, 2021, uh, they would come back to school next year and take either the same courses or those courses that are closely related or connected to those then you will need to fill out that form by May 1st, 2021. It is in the newsletter today, so click that link and fill that out. Um, so what will happen next, after you fill that out, I will have a session, an informational session, where I'll invite all of the people who have expressed that interest on that form, and we will, I'll share all of the details and information so you'll know what you are committing to as a family, and what we are committing to as a school district. Then, upon that um, uh, meeting, after that, our board will decide by June 1st if our district will be uh, joining in the supplemental year. And that decision will be all or none. So they'll decide not one by one, but as a district, if we are accepting all of your applications or, or none of them. Um, that will be by June 1st. After that point in time, you could decide for sure and obligate yourself or your student to that supplemental year. So we are continually getting guidance on that and informing our board. And so what I wanna remind you of today is that you have to sign that form, you have to submit that to be able to be considered in that supplemental year. If you have other questions and you wanna to talk to me about that individually, you can email me at susan.dougal at shelby.kyschools.us or you can call us here at the board office and I would love to talk to you about um, the opportunity there. The other thing I wanna to talk to you about today is another opportunity for your kids. Um, we are offering some wonderful opportunities this summer and it's called Expedition IL-3. Uh, there, every school is offering some summer learning opportunities at their school. If you are going to be a part of that, they will invite you. And if you want to be invited, if your student wants to be invited to attend those expeditions at the school, please contact the principal, the school office to let them know. Also, we have some district-wide expeditions, just like our usual summers, uh, where your students can sign up for some district-wide expeditions. Those are also included in today's newsletter. So take a look at those. There's some really neat offerings around gardening and art and golf and engineering and cooking and drama and music and it just goes on and on and on. Our teachers are passionate about those things and they want to share that interest and passion with your kids. So make sure you take a look at that today. If you have any questions about anything academic, you can always reach out to me. Um, and thank you for all you do to support our schools, and we want to continue to support you and your student. We 
also don't want you to forget about the Dogwood Festival. The Shelby County Education Foundation is sponsoring the Dogwood Festival this year. It's coming back after many, many years of being on hiatus, and we will be here, rain or shine. We have some wonderful baskets here that will be a part of a silent auction. We have many booths and some food trucks and a lot of activities, things for the kids to do. And we will also be dedicating Bugs Books, the little library that's dedicated to our own Duane Puckett. So come on out and join the celebration tomorrow. Again, rain or shine, 10 to 5 at Shelby County Public Schools Central Office. Where you fall.